So if your Windows 11 device is running slow with lots of problems or you decided to give this to your friend or family member or if you want to sell it then you must factory reset your device to restore all the settings to the default and today in this video guys I will be sharing easiest way to restore your device to the factory setting without having any advanced knowledge. Alright so basically there are two methods to factory reset your device. Number one is the standard method which is applicable for all the users who are able to boot into their Windows 11 device. And the second one is the advanced method and is only uh, for the user who are not able to boot into their Windows 11 device and are being stuck on the blue screen or any kind of advanced option of blue screen. So I will be discussing about both the situation but first let's see if you are able to access your Windows 11 then first what you have to do right click on the Windows icon and here from the suggestion you will have to click on settings in the settings from the left hand side you will have to look for system click on it and then on the right hand side you will find many different options but what you need to look for will be the recovery so look for recovery once you get it click on it and here below the recovery option you get reset this pc so click on it and the very next page that you will be getting will be like this and it will ask you you want to keep my file or remove everything so let me explain you both this option if you go with the first option then it will be removing application and setting but it will keep your personal file means all the settings and application will be removed and it will be set to the factory settings without deleting your personal data and in the second option it will be deleting all the application all the settings all the data and all the file so now here the question is that how you will decide that which option you should go with so let me tell you if you want to continue uh, using this device and if you have a bit of problem like lagging and slow then you can go with the first option without deleting your data but if you really want to make your device factory resetted by cleaning each and everything or if you want to give this to your family friend or if you want to sell it then it's highly recommended that you choose the second option. Alright, so I will choose here, remove everything. Next, it will ask you, you want to go with the cloud download or the local reinstall. The cloud download, what it will do, it will be downloading a fresh copy of Windows 11 ISO from the internet. And then it will be resetting using that ISO. And cloud download will also take a long time because it will be downloading a fresh copy of Windows 11 ISO from the internet. But keep in mind that if you have any Windows 11 that's really working very terrible, horrible, the files are being corrupted, it's lagging a lot, then I always recommend you that you should go with the cloud download. Then you have the local reinstall. Now it will be reinstalling the Windows using the same ISO that has been saved on your device. It will take lesser time as compared to the cloud download. So if you are in hurry and you do not have too much of extreme problem, then you can go with a local reinstall. All right. Now next it says additional setting, remove application and file, do not clean the drive, reinstall windows from this device. Then you click on change settings and it gives you two different more options. Clean data, just remove your file. This is quicker, but less secure. Download windows, reinstall windows from this device. So these are basically the advanced option and as of now both the options are being selected to no and in the clean data it says no just remove your file this is quicker but less secure but once I enable it it says clean the drive this may take hour but will make it harder to recover file. So you need to make this option to yes if you are selling this computer to any kind of a stranger or even if you are uh, giving this device to your family or your friend and you want that none of the data can be recovered and you want to completely wipe it and then want to give to anyone else then you should check this option and keep in mind guys that it will be cleaning the drive and it may take a long time then you have the download windows and if you make it to yes it says download and reinstall windows so in simple words if you also check this option it will automatically download a fresh copy of windows and it will be reinstalling windows using that iso so these two options are basically for the people who want to give their computer to anyone else especially to any kind of stranger so then you have to keep this option yes and then finally you will have to click on confirm 
it will give you the preview here again click on next and it says ready to reset this pc remove all the personal file and user account remove all application reinstall windows from this device this will take a while so finally you will have to click on reset and the process will now be started so this was the standard method through which you can easily factory reset your pc or your laptop by choosing different options according to your requirement so now this may take some time to reset your device first it will be preparing for the reset then finally it will be resetting your device and depending on the option if you have selected to reinstall windows then it will be reinstalling the windows and after that you will be getting where you will be instructed to choose your country and region so choose your uh, region choose your language now while proceeding with this option later you will be getting the microsoft account information where it will ask you to log in with a microsoft account and if you want to go with that microsoft account then you can basically uh, continue but if you don't want to go with a microsoft account and you want to bypass it and continue using a local account like me then here on this language and region page only you will have to press shift and f10 key so press and hold the shift key and press the f10 key all together and you will be getting a black command prompt here you have to type a simple command that will be start space ms dash cxh double colon local only i will leave this command in the description just type this command hit the enter key and it will bypass each and everything and it will give you another box here where you have to enter your local account username and the password so type your desired username type your password i will skip password as of now and then you have to click on next and after that all the microsoft account information will be bypassed and it will directly take you to the desktop or either it will ask you to enable the location and all so just enable those or disable those and then it will take you to your desktop so this was the first method the standard method through which you can easily reset your device depending that what kind of requirement you have now let's move with the advanced method where i believe that you are stuck on the blue screen like automatic repair loop or starter repair fail or the advanced page so if you are on a startup repair or automatic repair loop then you will have to click on advanced and it will take you to this kind of page here and then here you have to click on troubleshoot then click on reset this pc and again it will ask you the same option keep my file or remove everything so as i said if you want to completely wipe your device you want to clean it or if you want to sell it to someone or if you want to give to anyone else i highly recommend you to go with the remove everything then again you have to choose cloud download or local reinstall so if you're selling to someone else you can also go with local reinstall but if you are resetting the device because it's not working properly and you want to fix it then i would recommend you to go with the cloud download option and then finally it will ask you you want to fully clean the drive so yes uh, go with the fully clean the drive and follow the steps and the further steps will be same it will be resetting your device installing the windows depending which option you have chosen. and again once the windows will be resetted once it will be installed you will be coming to the same page where you will be instructed to choose the language your region so if you want to continue using the microsoft account then you can choose your language choose your region and continue filling all the information but if you want to bypass it then again you have to use the same method as i told you in the previous step so that's all guys for today and hopefully now you're very sure how you have to factory reset your device and which option you have to use and if you really find the information useful, please hit the like, subscribe and I see you in the next video. Bye bye.